So I'm going to start off logarithmic equations covering the principle of logarithmic equality. And that sounds like a mouthful, but it's really just this simple idea right here. It's a bit like exponential equality. If you have a logarithm on both sides of an equation, same log, same base, then you can just come along and cancel it out. And you can say a equals c. Now, it really has to be the same. This only works if you just have plain old log base b on both sides. So 2 log base b, that's not going to work. Um, you can't have some number plus log base b and just cross out all the logs. That, that's not how it works. You really just need logarithm by itself on both sides, and then you can just cancel it out. So we'll do an example of that. In this one, I have log base 3 of some stuff equals log base 3 of some stuff. And because there's nothing else going on in this equation, right, it's just log base 3 on both sides. I can just come along and by the principle of logarithmic equality, cross those things out and say this equals 8 omega plus 7 and 6 omega minus 5. And now we just solve for the variable like we would before. Okay, I'm going to do minus 6 omega from each side. And that gives me 2 omega plus 7 on the left and negative 5 on the right. So we'll subtract 7 from both sides, and we get 2 omega equals negative 12, divide by 2, and you get omega equals negative 6. Okay?